In Morocco, the devastation is severe following last week's powerful earthquake that has killed more than 2,000 people so far. Chris Demio reports on the latest. Search and rescue teams in Morocco still frantically combing through the rubble for survivors after a massive 6.8 magnitude earthquake slammed the country Friday night. The powerful tremor is reducing many homes and structures to piles of debris. The number of dead soaring to more than 2,000 as of Sunday night and is only expected to keep climbing. Every house here is broken. The United Nations estimates roughly 300,000 people have been affected by the disaster. Many survivors who lost everything are now forced to sleep in the streets as they await food, water and other donations. Many people need mattresses and to give um, them some hope in this terrible, terrible situation. Navigating badly hit towns and villages can be risky as people fear what's left of many damaged buildings may continue to crumble around them. You hear the sounds of the wall cracking. Every time a person passes by here, part of the wall falls. The United States and France have offered aid. As of Sunday, Moroccan officials said they are only accepting assistance from Spain, Qatar, Britain and the United Arab Emirates. Survivors in remote mountain towns say resources aren't getting to them fast enough. These people are suffering since last Friday when the earthquake struck. Since then, no one from the authorities paid a visit to us. Local people are helping each other. They are sharing their meager resources as well as anything they get from benefactors or charities. Chris DeMeo, Fox News.